Dr. Lockman from Cool Dental. Moms always want to know, is my child going to need braces? Well, here's a simple test you can all do at home to see is the function of the mouth working properly? Are the teeth growing in right? Or am I looking at problems coming down the road? It's what we call the tongue tie test. Here is what we consider a normal tongue. This is the lower jaw and the person can easily raise their tongue and touch the roof of their mouth. The frenum, this little band of tissue here, allows good movement. The tongue can come out very easily, but more importantly, it can raise to the top of the mouth. A normal swallow, you want to see that tongue easily going up into the palate because the tongue is what shapes the growth of the upper arch, the upper palate. So if the tongue's not moving well, then you're not swallowing well, and then you're not getting proper growth of the jaw bone on the top. If the jaw bone doesn't grow well, then you're probably looking at some amount of crowding and orthodontic problems coming. Here's what we call a moderate tongue tie, okay? So you can see when this person tries to raise their tongue, the frenum is already very tight and they cannot raise their tongue much higher than what you see in the photograph. They definitely cannot reach the palate and as a result, the upper jaw bone ends up growing narrow. And if it grows narrow, you can bet the teeth, instead of being straight, will be all crowded and rolled in on each other. Okay? Here's what we consider a severe tongue tie. You can see the lower jaw, the lower teeth. This person is trying to raise their tongue. No matter how much they try, the freedom is so strong that's as high as they can raise their tongue. Doesn't show well, but there's already the upper teeth folding in on themselves and the upper arch is not growing properly. So if you have anything like this in your own mouth, you probably want to get it looked at. If your children have a very severe tongue tie or even a moderate tongue tie, several procedures can be done to release this freedom and work on proper growth and development of the tongue musculature and hopefully get your child growing properly to minimize the amount of braces that are required or at very least get the child into proper treatment as soon as possible. Okay, hopefully that helps. Have a good day.